Eric, where you at? What's up, Amber? Well, you need to get to a store and pick up the magazine. You are not going to believe this. No, I haven't gotten it yet. No, I'm not going to say nothing. You just need to go and get it. All right? Talk to you later. Chat. Yo, what's up, Amber? Did you see who was on the cover of Runner's World magazine? Nah, I ain't get it yet. You need to go get a copy of it. All right. <laughs> I'll talk to you later. Talk to you later. So, that's that. Out of the two of them, one of them going to buy it. This way, I don't have to buy it. Yeah. I just got it. Uh -huh. we'll talk later. What's up, sis? Yeah, I just got it. I'm looking at it now. All right, I'll talk to you. So I copped it. So what do you think the big brouhaha was about? I don't know, maybe the 22 shoe reviews? That's all you think about is kicks. Not at all, man. Nah, I don't think so. She's probably talking about the fact that she's black. What does that have to do with it? It's unprecedented. You think it was strategic? Quite possibly. Smooth by design. People are always gonna have something to say, man. Yeah, you know that's happening already. She got on booty shorts, you know? I don't like the color, you know? She should have been bigger, you know? And if she was bigger, somebody would said, why is she so big? You know, she ain't running. She's probably eating donuts. You're not gonna please everybody, man. I'm just saying if Biggie would have said, you know, they're gonna get out the hood is if he won a full in two hours tops instead of slinging track lock and having a wicked jump shot, maybe more people have been running. Who knows? I mean, it could have very easily been K-Rod or E-Boogie on the cover. Did you say E-Boogie? K-Rod? You don't know who they are? You should ask somebody. Man. My point is, it doesn't matter. People always gonna have something to say.